Hello everyone, it's ODSC0920 here. Hope you're having a great day. Um, so today, I present to you the Taga E Heavy Tank. Um, there's some slight differences between this tank and the Tiger 1. Um, most notably is armor. So you see right here how uh, the armor itself is it's very smooth. You know, there's not a lot of uh, like other stuff, you know, looking different on it. Then you look at the Tiger E, you have this paste stuff or something like that on here. And anyway, it's supposed to help with thickness of the armor or something like that, right? Um, no, but not honestly though. There's between Tiger E and Tiger 1, uh, there's, a, there's, there's a couple of differences. Um, most notably are the engine inside here. Um, supposed to give you like an extra 100 horsepower or something like that and you got this this pace on here oh yeah sorry I said that the I forget the name of the pace I have to look it up again though uh, but also got some extra armor on the bottom right here in the lower glacis plate we have tracks and stuff like that um, and also this tank uses the APCR ammunition and you can have like up to like what 220 millimeters penetration or something like that yeah I'm going to take this thing out and uh, shoot some Russian tanks and whatnot with this thing. Alright, so we've broken out the Tiger E here. And we're going straight into battle. Hopefully, you know, might be able to hide behind some of our uh, teammates here. And provide some sniping cover fire stuff. Yeah! All that good shit. Alright, so my ammo... Ooh, okay, so I probably want to angle myself so that way my left side is pointing towards the enemy and the right side is facing away. I need to get into a perfect position to snipe at. I don't want to do good here. Although I might have to, so I don't have a choice maybe? Nah. I think I can go over here. Yeah, I'll think I'll just chill right here. Maybe, maybe not. It might be safe to advance. Although, maybe not. Oh, okay, that's a Sherman Firefly. Gotta be careful with him. He can one-shot me as much as I can one-shot him. Plus that T-34 is looking at him as well. Oh shit, I'm on the hill. There we go. Now I got some good gun depression. I think that's what you call gun depression. Yeah, I'm not rushing in there. Well. He ain't going anywhere, so you can basically kill him if he... Nope, he's not going to be able to kill him. I'll have to kill him for him. Goodbye. Yes, what? Hit. Come on. Here we go. Saved him. We can't move. You motherfucker. Pop your fucking tank out again. Let's go. Oh shit. That's right. Stay right there for me. Thank you. You're a dumb motherfucker, you know that? Next 
Do not underestimate the power of the tiger. It will consume you. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and fly here. Maybe yeah, I can change the tire of the battle here. <coughs> oh. My voice cracked a little bit. <laughs> oh shit. I better get over there fast before I get shot up with a T-34. I'm gonna watch the kill feed here. See if I do get... Uh oh, that's a Tempest. Gonna save me! No, 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 no! Uh oh, uh oh. I can just turn a little bit this way. And booyah, oh shit, nope, nope. <laughs> oh no! Alright, might as well abandon ship. Drop the bombs. Alright, gotta be careful here. Gotta play very sneaky like. Sneaky beaky. Must hide a very big tank. Oh, why, hello there. That's another tiger. Hey, he's on fire. Please move out of my way. Thank you. Oh shit, that's an I oh god. That's a big fucking tank. Yeah, this is gonna happen. Probably shouldn't have stopped, I should have probably just kept backing up. That's right though. Three kills in one life, that's pretty good. It would have helped if that IS-1 was in the way though. So I will go again. I'm getting that same spot and get some revenge. Or maybe go around and flank him. Yeah, that's what we'll do. We'll go this way, eh? I'm going to run him and cut him up the ass. Hmm, yes. No, I can still kick ass with this tiger. <coughs> with this tiger. Ooh. I do apologize for my voice cracking and sounding all garbage and shit. Allied forces have captured a zone. Alright, we're gonna roll in here. We're gonna kill that fucking SU-152. Oh god. Okay. We can roll this. Or we can definitely Okay. Yep, we're stuck. Oh shit. This was a bad call made by me. Um Right, we can totally get out of this mess. I know we can. I believe in the tiger. Might be a heavy tank, but son of a bitch it can get itself out of these sticky situations. Onwards, Tiger One. Onwards. Almost made it. Got it. Oh, I saw the tank right there. I don't think we can actually get him quite yet. Hey, we're able to convert this bomber. 
Plus three planes. Oh yeah, that's for damn sure. Easy kills. Got the guy that killed me. They're gonna spas are weak. Oh shit. Huzzah. We still got this. Should cut into their territory. And drive the Russians out of their land. With our new Tiger ones. And their squadron of Panzers, we can definitely do this. That was indeed a one shot and one kill. We are indeed outnumbered, but not outgunned. Oh, look, I'm the same spot as I was before. That was a miss! We cannot afford another miss. Okay, I guess we can. Working on it. Not very easy, you know. Try to do a snapshot. Booyakasha! Okay, I did head across open ground like that. Need to cut this way. There's also enemy tanks over here. Might be able to go out and flank them. Ooh, excuse me. Oh yeah, five and one, that's what I'm talking about. But yeah, as you can see, the uh, Tiger E is pretty decently armored until it comes, comes up against a SU-152 at pretty much any range. It will decimate it. However, um, T-3485s, if you're sitting at a long range, typically they won't kill you, but if you get close, then you're pretty much done for. Um, yeah, that's just about it, guys. Anyways, hope you enjoyed the video guys, give it a like, comment, and or subscribe if you want to see more of these videos. Peace.